Previously on Arden Hills. I don't know why I say these things! <laughs> it's deep inside you're just a jerk, that's why. In this episode, Steve sobers up, gets a haircut, and tries to get a new chick on a game show. Okay, Adrian, this is your last question. Brandon, if you were an animal, would you be a tiger, a puppy, or a shark? Uh, I don't know, uh, uh. I guess I'd be a, a puppy. Oh, Brandon, you dirty dog. Okay, Celeste, you're up. This is for Steve. If you could take just three things to a desert island, what would they be? Let's up them four. Coors Light Party Ball. You. <laughs> Ooh, sounds serious. And we'll be back for more Love at First Sight right after this. Don't go away. Friend, lay off Celeste, man. I need to have sex with her to make Kelly jealous. That's the game. Steve, I can't help it if we're both hot for the same girl. Oh, jeez. All right, we're back for our final lightning round, which will determine which lucky couple gets to go on our Love at First Sight dream date. All right, Steve and Brandon have both picked oh, Celeste. Celeste. Mark has chosen Cynthia, late. and now it's the girl's turn. So let's see if we have a match. Cynthia, who have you chosen for your dream date? Oh. Cynthia picked Steve. All right, there's no match there. Now, Adrian, you weren't selected, which means you'll already be returning in our next group of contestants. But let's see who you pick just for fun. Brandon. Oh. And finally, Celeste, a very popular lady right now. Celeste, have you fallen in love at first sight? Yes. So who is it? Brandon or Steve? Steve. All right, we have a match. Celeste and Steve. Are we in love at first sight? Well, hey, Kelly, if you're out there, I hope you're jealous. Because Celeste is kind of hot. I'm almost hotter than you. Well, you look like you're ready to plan a big one right on that gorgeous kisser of his right here and right now. Well, go on, go for it. Oh, yeah, baby. I'll show him I can be a slut, too. <laughs> 